Bismillah Rahman Rahim. In this video session, I will show you the working of control statement. This is an if statement. We also call control statement, decision statement, selection statement, and condition statement. Let's start the session. What will be the output of the following code? If I will execute this code, how my program will be executed, what are the steps will be involved, and what will be the output of that steps. First of all, on line number 1, x equal to 7, x is a variable that will get a value of 7. This is an assignment statement. Next, I have applied if statement, if x less than equal to 10, it will check whether this condition is true. In this case, x means 7, 7 is less than equal to 10, that is true. If it is true, the part or a statement following of if will be executed now x equal to welcome now x will get a value that will be welcome and fourth one is the print x it will print welcome on the output screen this is program number one so this is program number two what will be the output of the following code if i have written x equal to 17 and if x less than equal to 10 x equal to welcome otherwise it will print x and number 4 is print x. Now x equal to 17, the value of x is 17. It will check 17 is less than or equal to 10. 17 is less than or equal to 10. It means this condition is false. In case of false, the following of if statement, this may be a one statement or bundle of statements that will be ignored. If the if condition will false, then all the statement will be ignored. If that if the condition will true, then all the statement will be executed. Now in this case, x equal to welcome will be ignored and print x. It will print the value of x that now in this case value of x is 70. Program number three. Suppose I have given a value x equal to true. Now value of x is true. And next I am going to check if x and I did not write any condition. It means here I am going to check if x equal equal to true. The value is true. Okay. Now x is already contained the value true. Now if x equal equal to true, it means that condition is true. Is x is true? Yes. The value of x is already true. Then it will get the value in x that is yes. Because the condition on line number 2 is true. If the condition is true, the following of if statement will be executed. That is x equal to yes. But line number 4 and line number 5 will be ignored. Why? Because if the given condition is true, then else part will be ignored x equal to no this will be not executed the value of x is yes it will print yes in output screen now this is the fourth program x equal to 15 value of x is 15 now i am going to test the condition if x is greater than equal to 10 it means 15 is greater than equal to 10 this is true in case of true the line number 3 will be executed and what is going on this is a string assignment to variable x this will be executed mean value of x will get greater than or equal to 10 x will get a value that is greater than or equal to 10 and else part will be ignored why because the first condition that is x greater than or equal to 10 is 10 is true if the first condition is true, then the part or block of else will be ignored. Now next one is print. It will display greater than or equal to 10. Thanks students. If you like my video, please subscribe my channel. Thank you. Jazakallah khair.